George, how will the protesting impact the local business economy here in Philadelphia? I want to bring in the executive director of the Greater Philadelphia Chamber of Commerce, Matt Cabri, with us right now. Matt, good to see you. Great to be here, Thank Maria. You so Thanks much for having for joining me. Us. So, how big of an economic boost do you think the Democratic National Convention will be on Philly and the Greater uh, Philadelphia area? Yeah, so this is significant in that we expect to see an uptick in some of uh, what we call the expected uh, industries, you know, transportation, tourism, uh, the hospitality sector, telecommunications, photography, event production, things like that. But generally speaking, we're managing expectations well. We'll definitely go to see an uptick compared to last July, for example. But we really only expect about a three hundred to four hundred thousand dollar economic impact based on all the activity, because there are costs associated with delivering a program like this as well. So it all balances out. The real upside is greater awareness. When we get greater Philadelphia on the national and international stage, it's really beneficial. So long term, when we can get that message out about doing great business in greater Philadelphia, it's really perfect. And, and doing great business, you want to attract as many businesses as possible. How are you going to attract businesses to come up and set up shop here in Philly? Yep, absolutely. We reach out to them, we set up sessions, and we basically articulate the great assets we have here. Everything from our talent, which is really key for us, uh, to our transportation infrastructure, our accessibility, our proximity. Here's a great fun fact for you. 60% of the U.S. population is accessible within two hours of uh, greater Philadelphia. So if you're in an industry that relies on distribution channels and you have goods and services that you're looking to distribute, this is a great gateway into the greater Philadelphia yeah. region for a European or Asian company. I love the city. It's a great city. You're right. Yeah. And it's very accessible. Yeah. Absolutely. absolutely. Lots of fun. Yeah. We're enjoying it. Thanks yeah. for your yeah. hospitality. Yeah, absolutely. Welcome. Uh, you, you said that some of the big uh, revenue generators in the city are what? Uh, you said life sciences. Yeah, life sciences is huge. And a lot of this goes back actually to our history. So we're a, a very uh, rich uh, city, as you know in history it's where our country was founded but it's also key to know that the first hospital the first university the first pharmaceutical school was established here and today that translates into a very robust R&D life sciences Matt good to see you thanks yeah. so much thanks